I'm genuinely pissed off right now. Do you want to know why I'm genuinely pissed off right now? Because I just took my fucking driving test. And guess how long I tested for? Go ahead, I'll let you guess. 30 seconds. I fucking tested for 30 seconds. My instructor was such a douchebag, it's not even funny. Okay. So here's how it goes. I walk into the DMV, and there's these two instructors that I already know about because I have friends that went to the CMV to take their tests, and they told me about them. I saw them, there was this one biker guy, and then there was this other guy. And they were nice. They were greeting everybody at the door, and they're like, Hi, how are you? Are you excited to take your test today? Things like that. They're just trying to have a conversation. And then there's this third asshole who didn't acknowledge me, and he's walking around with his clipboard, all pissed off. Like, I could already tell that this guy is gonna be a hard ass. So I'm like, alright, hopefully I'll get one of the other guys, because they're nice, they're greeting everyone at the door, so they must have a personality, you know? Must have a personality somewhere down there. So I'm sitting there, and I'm waiting for my name to be called, and out comes the fucking salty ass Mr. Krabs guy. That's his name, because he was fucking salty. So Mr. Krabs calls my name, and I walk up to him, and I'm like, eh, hello? Like, he didn't even say anything, he just called my name. So I'm like, hi, how are you? And he's like, I'm good. And I'm like, okay, cool. And then he's like, okay, first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna get in your car and roll down the driver's window. So I got in the car, rolled down the driver's window. He's testing the blinkers, he's testing the brake lights and everything like that. Everything was fine. He got in the car. I adjusted my mirrors. I said out loud, helpful hint, even though it didn't get me fucking far. Always announce out loud or just make it very obvious that you're checking your mirrors because they will check you on that. Everything was fine. Where's that fucking piece of shit paper? Hold on. As you could see, I crinkled it up out of anger, rightfully so. Tires check, brakes check, lights check, other check, adjust seat check. Adjust mirrors, check. Fasten seat belts, check. <sighs> he tells me, okay, when you're ready, pull out and take a left. I pull out and I take a left. He's like, all right, keep going down the parking lot a little bit more. And in this last parking spot here, you'll see the cones. And I'm like, yep. He's like, you're going to back into those. Okay, back into them. First try, he said, you will have three tries to back into this parking space. Perfect! Backed into it on the first try. Perfectly fine, I just have to adjust it a little bit because the front is a little crooked. So I pull out a little tiny bit, maybe an inch, maybe an inch or two, and I just straighten out the car back in and everything's completely straight. He says, okay, good. Now pull out. So I pull out, he says, take a right, Kind of confusing because that's the direction I came from and that's not the direction of the exit of this place. So I'm taking a right now. All right, take a right. He says, pull into any one of these parking spots. And I'm like, do you want me to back into them? And he's like, nope, just pull in. So I pulled into a parking spot. He said, put the car in park and get out. Sorry, I just had to look at myself. So I put the car in park, and I instantly know that something's up, because I know that wasn't the whole test. And uh, he says, you tapped a cone. So... $70 to take this test and like a 30 minute drive to get out here and I took the test for 30 seconds sir are you fucking kidding me so I said okay all right thank you thanks are you fucking kidding me Yep. Just wanted to get that off of my chest.
I'm very annoyed right now. So that's the story about how I failed my driving test in 30 seconds. <sighs> Have a great day. Bye.